and I like the Spidey sense. I, I really like yeah. how they they kept slows the down Spidey time. And... I, I didn't say that, but the way they. Uh... <laughs> I'm trying to keep spoilers out of it, but. Uh... <laughs> One of the things that we wanted to talk about this month is probably one of the best PS4 games of this generation, Spider-Man, right? If, yeah. Yeah. if you uh, watch YouTube around the internet, you've been bombarded with Spider-Man. I think, hell, we've probably had three streams, I think, on it ourselves, <laughs> right? Yeah. The so, most, uh, I think, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. One game? Yep. Well, two so, official. We're going to not talk about any story spoilers at all. This is going to be a completely non-spoiler conversation, even though Jeff has platinumed it and Corey's a good chunk <laughs> of the way through it. Me and Dirk have basically not touched it. Just the very beginning, right? Have you played it at all, Dirk? How I did play tonight. I, like uh, an hour, or what do you... Uh, yeah, I'm probably about three hours in. Okay, okay. so... You're probably farther than me than even. And so we'll just say, again, no spoilers, but want to just talk about, you know, what outside of the story, because clearly we'll, we'll have that conversation later. But the, what, what really makes this game kick for so many people, I think, is just how fun it is to be Spider-Man, how awesome it feels to go around Manhattan and whatnot, well, right? I, think I mean, they, yeah. they captured... They captured the essence of what it's like to play Spider-Man in a video game. I mean, of all the Spider-Man games I've played that have come out, this one is the most fluid yeah. and immersive of all of them. Nate, yeah. did, did you uh, play Spider-Man 2, Nate? That was yes. terrible. No, everyone says the Spider-Man 2 was great. Was the, the best. Yeah, that that oh, was yes. the PS1? best. PS1? Oh. Yes. Yeah, and this that's what everyone... Every, everyone who's played Spider-Man 2 who hasn't played the new one says, is it as good as Spider-Man 2 as far as swinging around the city? Right. And, <clears throat> because the very right. first Spider-Man game on PS1 had it so that uh, he just like shot webs straight up into the air into outer space. Like you could just <laughs> go through without buildings and he would fly around the city. Oh. The, in Spider-Man 2, they put the little icons on the corners of the buildings and whatnot. So for the first time ever, you could swing back and forth and, and around corners and things like that. And and yeah, I, I think no comparison. This game's so much better. I think yeah. if you went back and played Spider-Man 2, you would right. laugh at it compared to this game. This is <laughs> so sure. much more smooth and nice. Yeah. The other thing that Spider-Man 2 failed at was a lot of inside missions where the camera broke oh. and going down hallways and yeah. stuff, the mechanics didn't feel great. Like in, in this game, I feel like whether you're inside or outside, controlling Spider-Man feels awesome. It feels does. great. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, even yeah, even if you can't swing, you're still very mobile inside mm -hmm. and you just and can do cool shit. And, uh, yeah, it's yeah, so fun. And doing tricks. And, the tricks uh, are fun. If you want to... You know the way you can like boost towards something and then boost off of it and just like fly. you can you can make yourself go super fast yeah. and and but or you can just enjoy the swing and I find that I do both depending on like the mood I'm in half time I'll just get lost in swinging around buildings like having a good time <clears throat> but if you wanna if you wanna destroy the physics and just blast forward you know you can <clears throat> it's it, it you just mix them up <clears throat> yeah. It you, you you sort of like when Corey, you know, if you're wanting to transverse all the entire island of Manhattan, you just get into this rhythm of swinging, and you'll just you'll swing out and let go and let him you know, yeah like you fly see, down. He'll fly and, and, and then he swings again, and you just it, it just is so much fun and therapy. It's very nice. To, yeah, it so, reminds me of it feels like an infamous game on steroids to me. Which is what it should, yeah, absolutely, yeah. right, absolutely. Yeah. It's almost exactly what that is. Yeah. And the, so, they did a great way of like showing you the speed, because if you get up on the Empire State Building and you just dive off of it and dive straight down, yeah, you, oh, no, yeah no. I get nervous and I'm like, I've got to pull up because I'm just going <laughs> to hit the ground. Right. I take it yep. to the fucking last inch every time. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and I'll just say the. The combat is great in it too. Uh, like at first glance, when you looked at it, it looked like it was going to be Arkham Knight, um, as far as combat goes. But I feel like in Arkham Knight, you can just drop down in a group of enemies and just punch them, 
until they're all dead. Agreed. You can't you can't do that in this. You have to you know, slide under them and use your gadgets and, and combos, know every yeah. different types of enemies' weaknesses and and yeah and combos and it's it's actually pretty intricate and it's and really fun. It's they they nailed the combat for sure. <clears throat> It, from from Batman Arkham Knight, a lot of times it was it was hard to judge when the enemies were going to swing, so you could dodge it. With the Spider Sense, yeah, it makes it really easy, and you just get used to it. And then if if you play this, and then you try to play something else like Monster Hunter World, you really suck at those other games. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They only have two yeah. buttons. <laughs> Spider Man really only has like two buttons. For attack, yeah. square and triangle, and dodge and <laughs> circle. So, uh, I really like the mechanics in, in battle. I uh, there was a, a a a certain boss early on that forced me to master it, and it was not easy. But then, yeah. you yeah. know, once you learn it, you love it. Yeah. You're like, yeah, yeah. You really have to apply it to other fights. Well, and, and I think that's how they mask the tutorial. They mask the tutorial really. I mean, yeah, you get the little pop ups to tell you. It's like a three hour it's, tutorial. It, it is, but. <laughs> but it's great. But it's, yeah, you're right. Yeah. It's great. And yeah. that first boss you fight, he hits like a fucking freight train and it teaches you to dodge <laughs> and how to throw. Yeah. yeah. That's you have another to. thing is, yeah. is just how easy it is to use your webs to pick up objects in destructible environment and throw it back. Yeah, yeah. I love that. Yeah. Totally. All right, so just kind of a couple other things, but, you know, clearly uh, this game, if, if you're watching the show, I feel like you already know, that, but maybe not, that, you know, Sony owns Spider-Man, which is why this is a PlayStation exclusive. Mm -hmm. um, pretty crazy that, you know, they went all in and basically made the best superhero period game ever. I mean, I, it, I, I feel like we would pretty much all agree this is better than the Arkham games, yeah. yes? Yep. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, and uh, and so it, it kind of a, I, I don't know, like one side of me is like super excited about this game, and and clearly there's going to be a sequel because this is super successful, and uh, but what I'd really love to see is like the, the Marvel MCU video Iron game Man. version, and yeah. that's not going to come out of this, right? No. Like it 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 kind of kind of breaks my heart. I'd I'd love to see like the Iron Man game be next. And then oh, the Thor game would be next, right? And then have them all come together at the end. Like, uh, uh, they it's might, a shame. They might, I feel like they could do that with their partnership. The way they, the way Disney and Sony is teamed up, I feel like that's not completely out of the question. I think you're <clears> totally <throat> wrong. I think with this being a Sony exclusive, that anything else that Disney is going to put their money towards is going to be multi platform Yeah, but didn't Marvel just issue a quote saying that this is the beginning of Marvel games, they they yeah, listed like, this as like, even yeah. though it's Sony, it's like Square One, where they the foundation of what they would like to yeah, build. Yeah, I consider their... this like the first Marvel game that's came out since you know Disney let them do their thing, and and it's a whole new. That's that was supposed to be the whole thing. Is the no, Disney, it's not the I, the next I thought game it was. Is, no, the next game is Crystal Dynamics, which is the Avengers, and it's going to have okay, zero right. reference to this game. Right. Yeah, that. Yeah. That, you know what uh, I mean? Like, I, I yeah, wish that right. they. You're right. Yeah. I wish that they would sit down together in a room and work it out, like they have with the movies, right? Uh, like they got some big shoes to fill to follow up this game. Finally, like you know, Jeff, you beat it, Corey. You played a lot of it. Where do you guys think? Where does this sit with PS4 games? Is this your favorite PS4 game ever? I've, is this? It's Does one of my favorite. God of War. It's. it's Jeff a, cried. It is a. I did cry, dude. I cried like a little girl. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, cause. All right. It was yeah. So I mean, it, at the beginning, God of War. I'm gonna have to think about this coming up December, but God of War had me going for game of the year. But because Spider Man made me want to actually complete 100 percent of 100 percent of this game. Yeah. It's going to be a toss-up. Sure. I right. would say uh, I, God of War, I, at this point in Spider-Man, I still would consider God of War and possibly Celeste um, better. <clears throat> I don't see how Spider-Man can beat God of War in my eyes. Yeah. To be I don't either. I, I'm, I'm I, deep in God I of War right do, now. I'm going to give it a I chance. I, yeah. I, I, haven't a chance it. I haven't beat it yet. So I, I, I'll hold my judgment.